Good morning. Getting a good night's sleep is one of the most important things that we could do for self-care. And everybody has their go-to oils of what work for them. But for me personally, I like to unwind at the end of the day, maybe with a little lavender and a bath or one of the bath bombs. But one of my regular routines is to use a cold air diffuser every night. And sometimes I'll use thieves, especially if I was around people that were coughing and sneezing on me. Um, sometimes I'll use RC or Raven if I need some extra respiratory support. But if I know my mind is having a little bit you know, of a hard time calming down, I personally go to Peace and Calm. Some people love lavender. I love Peace and Calm. It is definitely my go-to for helping create the environment that will support a good night's sleep. You want to use a cold air diffuser that doesn't heat the oils up. It stays in the air longer. It actually acts as an atomizer to break up the molecules so we can breathe it in more easily as well. These diffusers will, you can set it for four hours, six hours, or eight to 10 hours intermittently. And of course there's beautiful lights that happen, but of course, but I usually of course leave it off at night. Um, unless you want to use it as a nightlight. If peace and calm isn't doing it for me, the next level up for me is Rutavela. Rutavela, um, I usually love using the roll on cause it's pre-diluted. Um, it has some valerian. It's a little more, a little more of a step up as far as, um, sleep support goes. But if my mind really is not calming down, and I know that it's just going to be me laying there with a thrrrr, I use sleep essence. Sleep essence is a mixture of oils with melatonin. I take one um, 30 to 60 minutes before I want to go to sleep. You could take one or two. Um, I very rarely have even tried taking two. Um, one always does it for me. But um, Sleep Essence, Rudavela, Peace and Calm are my favorites to support a good night's sleep. And then when I wake up, <laughs> I'm ready to start the day right. And I'll pick one of the oils that you might see above your head. And today I'm picking Joy. And when you take one of the drops, you just hold it to 45 degrees. And I might put a little bit over my heart. Take a few deep breaths in, set an intention for the day, and there we go. Good morning. Starting your day with some kind of affirmation, gratitude, prayer, whatever words you want to use for it is a very powerful way to set your intention as well as find that intention throughout the day. Adding oils to it brings it to the next level. So today I'm choosing release and energy. <laughs> So you could use these oils however you want. You could put them in your diffuser. You could put them on the bottoms of your feet. I love putting release on my liver. The liver is an area um, in body work where they say emotions often get stuck. The liver is on the right side of your lower rib cage. So as I place it there, I'll then bring my hands to my nose and breathe in with the intention of letting go a little bit more. All those worries, concerns, most of which are not going to happen. It helps bring me more to the present moment, let go of the stuff I've been holding on to, and then creating space for energy. So whatever your focus is for the day, you might want to breathe in an oil and see yourself doing that. You know, see yourself rocking that meeting or making an amazing video. <laughs> whatever your intention is for the day, breathe it in, see it, more importantly, feel it. Use the oils. It's going to help, you know, excite your whole brain and nervous system. And then if you take um, like energy, for example, with you throughout the rest of the, your day, it's going to help you recreate the state that you just created in the morning. Mm. Welcome to my kitchen. So nutrition is really an integral part of our self-care. We really are what we eat. And I know when I eat something processed, I feel, you know, a heaviness and a sluggishness. I mean, it's even just hard to digest, which lowers our energy. So I like to start my day um, with good choices because then that kind of sets the tone for the rest of the day. And I seem to make better choices the rest of the day. And I also don't have a ton of time in the morning. So I usually go with one of the protein shakes. Um, just so you know, before I did this video, I did um, 
a half of a dropper of our cool mint CBD. I've been making this a part of my regimen um, since Young Living launched it in the summertime and it's really made a huge difference for me, um, my mindset, my nervous system, and um, yes, I could elaborate if you'd like, but I love it and I love that we have a clean source that's also guaranteed for potency as well as purity. Very often you don't know what you're going to get and when you get CBD oils and also making sure you have a clean source is extremely, extremely, extremely important. So as far as protein shakes go, depending on what your goals are, um, the Pure Protein Complete is very high in, um, in five different kinds of proteins and they burn at different times. So it's really nice pre-workout or as um, recovery after a weight workout. I'm not going to be doing a heavy weight workout. I'm just going to go for a little walk. So I'm not going to do this today, but I often do that when I go to the gym. Um, Sleek is wonderful if you're trying to reduce your caloric intake. It's raw, it's vegan, um, and it's part of our weight management system. But today I'm going with my favorite, Balance Complete. Um, this is actually part of our five-day cleanse as well, in case you're ever wanting to do a cleanse. You actually do three of these shakes a day with two bottles of Ninja Red, and I usually do two shots of Ninja Red a day anyway, so I like mixing it in, especially if you're doing the Sleek. Um, this tastes fine to me with just water, but the Sleek, I need something a little bit more, so I mix it with either Ninja Red or the Sleek Essence um, drops that are citrusy and have a little stevia in it. But so I'm just adding this to my little shaker and I'm doing two scoops. And then I'm also, so this is a very balanced um, meal replacements. And so even just replacing one meal a day with a low calorie shake, because these are all under 200 calories, um, definitely decreases your, um, you know, your calories for the day if you're concerned about that but I use this more so because it's so full of vitamins and minerals and nutrients and because it's also infused with essential oils, it helps them be more bioavailable. So I still take my multivitamin. I'll take my master Fork formula as well at breakfast, but um, all of this makes me feel really energized. And when I get the right nutrition, I don't have the kind of cravings that I would have otherwise. I think sometimes when our body's not getting the nutrition that it needs, it, um, it tries to find them in carbs or chocolate. <laughs> I'm also going to put my MindWise in here. It's a supplement that I take every day as well. Um, it has CoQ10 and also the good fatty acids um, that are very healthy, not just for brain health, but for heart health. And I have both issues running in my family. So I'm just being super proactive about getting good fats. Mm -hmm. Don't want to waste any. <laughs> and then I just shake it up. Oh, it would help if I added water. <laughs> I just shake it up and sometimes I'll actually take it like that with me um, if I am running errands in the afternoon um, and then I'll just bring water separately and mix it so it keeps me from stopping, you know, to get some fast food or something. Um, if I get tired, that's what I go for. But if I have something like this in the car, then, um, then I could definitely do without it. Cheers. Regular exercise of your choice is such an important part of self-care. It increases energy, it improves your mood, it releases endorphins, and did you know that just 20 minutes of walking a day decreases your risk of heart disease, of diabetes, and there's also new studies that shows it also improves your memory. So when you are exercising, be sure to, of course, stay hydrated. And this is a glass water bottle, which means I could infuse it with essential oils of my choice. Today, I infused it with lemon oil because it's very high in D-limonene. Of course, it's uplifting when I smell it, but it's also very supportive to my immune system. I have something diffusing almost all day to help set the mood and the energy around me. Mindset is a key component to self-care. Using affirmations, incantations, intentions are so powerful and made even more powerful by pairing it with an essential oil and scents. Um, I always carry two things with me. I'm about to go into a meeting, so I'm going to choose between the Calm CBD Roller or Valor. And I'm going to choose Valor today. And all you need is a drop. 
And when you take the drop, go ahead and just rub your hands together. A few deep diaphragmatic breaths in and out through your nose, deep in your belly. Imagining how you want to show up, the energy you want to bring and feeling it now. Just taking 30 seconds across the, the span of your day to do things like this and reset is enough to completely change the energy of your day and make it more enjoyable, more productive, and allows you to have and create the state that you are looking for. Meeting was great. I'm back at the ranch and I had one more thing to share with you that has been very important in my self-care regimen. It did not happen overnight. In fact, it took about two years to make the switch of slowly ditching and switching my personal care and cleaning products and household products from the toxic things that I didn't even think about. I mean, I was eating organically. I was exercising. I was meditating, but every day I was smearing toxic lotions and personal care products all over my body um, using cleaners that were very toxic. And the average woman is exposed to 168 toxic chemicals a day. And um, the majority of those are before breakfast. So that's all of our skincare, our makeup, our hair stuff. And um, that's the real gift that Young Living gave to me. I got interested in the oils, but then I slowly learned that the lifestyle was about, you know, living healthier lives, less toxins. And as my background is in biobehavioral health, I knew that 95% of our health was lifestyle. Only 5% were genetics. So lifestyle was healthy eating, exercise, mindset, stress management. But the piece of the puzzle that was missing for me was environmental factors and the things that we bring into our home is something that we could control. So, I mean, I use the Thieves Cleaner that um, comes out to be less expensive than the dollar store cleaner that I was using before. <laughs> um, you just mix one ounce with 30 ounces of water, less if you're doing things like windows. I use everything from the laundry soap to the dish soap to my skincare. But if you're going to start, start with the things you use every day, toothpaste, deodorant, especially if your toothpaste has in the back of it if you ingest more than a tablespoon to um, call poison control because you might be um, spitting it out but sublingually you absorb even more quickly than through your skin um, and all of them are infused with essential oils that you know has powerful cleaning pro um, cleaning benefits but also benefits that will have to um, our skin, I have to say my skincare is incredible. I use the Art Skincare System and my skin looks definitely better than it did 10 years ago. It's infused with sandalwoods and frankincense. It's incredible. So the catalog is vast. I will post a link to it. I don't want it to be overwhelming. I want it to be an opportunity for you to see things that you already buy and maybe um, when it's time to buy them again, choose something that might be more beneficial. And things may look expensive, um, for example, you know, I thought the lotion was a little expensive. This is about the size of a pea. Now, if I was using other hand lotion, I would have went squirt, 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 because that's how much I needed. And then it would absorb and I need it again. This is the size of a pea and it covers my hands and then some. Um, the amazing thing is with some of our lotions and our lip balms, that you might get on the market, they're hydrating, but then they're also dehydrating at the same time. So you need more. That is not the case <laughs> with Young Living and everything is super, super concentrated. So you probably just need the size of a pea and things last a lot longer than you might expect. Like my eye serum, it um, was an ounce for like maybe $40. And I'm like, I could go through that in a day because that's <laughs> how much lotion I was using. My skin was so dry. I would just use less than a size of a pea. It lasts me for about nine months. If I knew that, I would have gotten it a lot sooner. So everything is very concentrated, especially with the, the dish soap. Like as an example, people got the dish soap for free. When you become a wholesale member, you get like free promos. And um, I actually have half dish soap, half water, because if you people were using the same amount of dish soap as they were regular dish soap and it was leaving a film on their dishes and it was because they were using way too much. So I actually diluted this down and it's a lot easier to use, but um, if you're not diluting it, use very little and it lasts such a long time. 
So if you guys have any questions, feel free to reach out. And I'm so happy to share um, some of my favorite tools and products that have definitely improved my self-care regimen. Um, that, and then that carries over to everything, to our immune system, to our overall health and happiness. Um, mindset is key. Joy to you. Happy oiling.